my Woofy, always late for work, brother. Yeah, bro, I've been stuck at home with the fucking flu because I'm still a bit sick, but I just done a COVID test that came back negative, so I was like, fuck it, I've got to get paid somehow, I better be here. Oh, it's good to have you here, mate, and you've parked finally as usual. But if you're ever oh, fucking shit. late again, mate, I covered for you, you know what I mean? What are you like, where's Steven shit? Are you? What are they on me? They're onto you, bro. They're wondering where you're at. I said you were just off saving kittens from trees and shit. I had your back. You know me, bro. I'll do anything to save a bit of pussy, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm getting the call, man. One sec. Uh, recruit uh, Mario Smith here. How can I help you? Of course, you're the one who answers. I've been calling around to every officer that I can try and get a hold of, and unfortunately, nobody has answered except for you. Right. I have a task for you. Can you please come to the Melbourne airport, so the one down south? Of course, sir. May I ask what the task is, or is it more of a see when I get there type thing? It's not necessarily a surprise. I just have somebody that I need you to transport. All right, Roger. On my way, sir. It's Benedict, man. <laughs> Oh my lord. Hey, how you going, Tilly? Hey, dudes. What's up? Well, I'm no longer uh, Tilly. Oh no, what's your name? Uh... <laughs> let me guess, let me guess. You had a sex okay. change, your name's Billy. Billy. <laughs> <laughs> no, what the what freak? Up, Billy. Billy, how are you? No, not Billy. Um, I am now actively seeing a girl called Teddy Bear. Teddy Bear. What? Why did you change the um, I was drunk and I had a shower and that's what I came up with. Well, Teddy Bear. It's a strange term. You still of call it. me Tilly. It's fine. All right. No, I'm going to call you Teddy Bear. I'm respectful. Anyway, we just got a really urgent phone call. What are we fucking doing? All right. Sorry, Tilly. It's Teddy Bear. We'll see you soon. Catch you later, Billy. Oh. All right. I guess we'll just go, in, go inside. What are the people for? Benedict said we have to pick someone up. All right. Let's turn around and talk yeah. over here for no reason. So are you really sick or are you just pulling my leg? Nah, straight up, bro. I'm a bit sick. Can you not hear my voice? Because I'm not, not quite myself today. Eh? I'll be honest with you. Is that even really yeah. you? What do you think I am? Some fucking clown, bro? Of course it's me. If it's you, do your iconic laugh. Yeah. Ah, uh, oh, it's you, it's you. Look into my eyes real quick. I'm gonna ask you mm -hmm. something only Wolfie would know. Okay, ask me. What's the name of my girlfriend? Leslie. Ah, it is you, you cheeky scallywag. What's the name of my girlfriend? Leslie. I how we Eskimo bros, bro. They really bring us closer together. It really right? does, man. We shared the same home. But the only issue is, every time I get her after you get her, it's like putting a worm in a tunnel, bro. Like, I can't even hit the walls. Yeah, man, I've got a fucking massive cop. Here they are. Oh, Hello, sir. Hey, good evening, gentlemen. Hey, mate, how are you? I'm doing well. My neck's a little bit stiff from the flight, but otherwise, pretty good. That's good. Did we not leave you deserted on an island at one point? I've never seen you before in my life. Well, all right then. Gentlemen, there's been a few issues over here in Melbourne where the gun crime has been incredibly increased. The public shooting at police, apparently some of the police doing some things they definitely should not have been doing. Speaking of which, I never got the body cam from you two. Um, yeah, the footage didn't render properly. It was awful. Yeah, I see. Did you want to introduce yourself, full name, and rank yeah, the Yeah, hello, so hello, gentlemen. My name is Bruce Brucey. I'm part of the NYPD. I'm here just to inspect and go over and even consult the local police, uh, police force down here in the beautiful Melbourne city. That's good to meet you, Bruce Brucey. It's good to meet you, too. Sorry, I'm still a little whacked out on the Xanax I took on the plane. It's a 16 and a half hour flight. I took the whole thing bar. Well, if you're taking a Xanax, Anyways. I'll take one, too. I want to be on the same level. Otherwise, it'll be weird. Well, yeah, I mean, look, it's legal here, right? Kind of. I've got a prescription, this is where we go. I've got a prescription let's, too, yeah, going. from a doctor. Okay. Yeah, this is gonna go great. Gentlemen, I need you to be on your best behavior, no funny business. This man is here to teach and also to learn. Yeah, it's an honor to have you along with us. You know, the water goes down the drain a different way here, but does crime go down the drain? No. Look, Benedict said he called every cop in the city, but no one was up for the task because we're the best cops here. And Benedict's words, I'm paraphrasing, but yeah. No, it's an honor to have you here, Bruce Brucey. Well, no now that all of you have been awkward at each other for the past couple of minutes. How about you get out of here? Yeah, it sounds, it sounds good. Hey, Smithy. Yo. We're just going to sit here and act like it's not our bro from the other, from the other week. I don't know, man. It seems like a completely new person and definitely not the same exact guy. Bruce, you're, really you're not bro. here to order us or anything, eh? Like, you're not here to, like, report on our activity, are you? I'm, I'm simply here to report and observe what you two men get down for as a member of the Melbourne Police Department. Mm. Strictly here to take notes and help you enforce it properly, okay? Oh, yeah, let's do a quick traffic stop. This guy's a bit reckless. Yeah, we'll do a quick traffic stop on this guy right here. Pull over! So, sir, do you know why we pulled you over here today? I'm not too sure, mate. Right? Sure. What's your best guess? Best guess is that you perceive this hat as not a helmet when it is. Exactly, not wearing your helmet. I have a big f***ing problem with people disregarding safety, especially when you're on the road. We have a big problem with that, man. When you're on the road and you're not wearing a helmet, or even worse, you're not wearing a f***ing seatbelt, 
Which I don't see you wearing a fucking seatbelt, do I? I don't see a seatbelt. You know, Wolfie didn't belt. wear a helmet last night. Now he has hepatitis. Sir, I don't like your attitude. I need you to see your ID. Right there, buddy. How you doing, Izzy? Okay, That's actually a super gorgeous oh, photo of you, bro. Wow. Wow. You know, I was being a real hard ass. I didn't know that you were so beautiful, Izzy. You had that oh, bad on. You're and gorgeous, Izzy. Like, Jesus, bro. Boys, okay, boys, you make me blush. Get out, get out of here, Izzy. Get out, you know, get out of here, Tiger. Oh, take the no, man. Go, what a beautiful human. Holy shit. Wow, he actually kind of took my breath away. My heart skipped a beat. Let's get back to work. Drifting. Drifting. Guys, I'm Brucey's I'm driving. <laughs> Go, Brucey. Go, Brucey. Please, pull over. Pull over. Oh, no. Get on the side of the road. Get on the side of the road. Did you say, did you say send it for Ricky? <laughs> I didn't say that. <laughs> no one said it. Nobody said, said, said it. Send it for Ricky. You send it for Ricky. All right, now I've said it. Oh, okay. You said I said it now. Oh, oh, shit. He's sending it for Ricky. Oh, no, Brucey, Brucey, you gotta chill. You gotta chill. Brucey, you gotta chill. Send it for Ricky, Just send it for Ricky. And we can pursue, but we gotta watch the pit maneuvers to an extent. Oh, okay. Jesus, Brucey! Oh, shit. That was not nice. Thank God, now. Oh. So, Brucey, why? Give us a give us a rundown. Why exactly are you here? I'm just here to, to hide in this police force, man. What you don't you don't trust my integrity? You don't trust reasons why I might be here? You don't think your police force could use some work? Hey, look, I think everyone can grow, and I think it's important to be open minded to growing, of course. But um, you just rammed yeah, was, a car I'm, like eight times. Just, is that just how you roll in America? In America, we have something called insurance. We have insurance companies that that pay for everything. Right. And what, does he have to put the bill? I don't know, man. Well, you didn't give him your what, insurance what your details. What's your police budget like? It's not good, in man. Ameri in America, our police budget's very good. Yeah, well, welcome to Australia, in man. In America, I crash cop cars for fun, just to get a just to get a sick little kick out of it. Do you wear your seatbelt or just fly out the windscreen? Is it like a... You know, you, we've been over this. The, I don't wear my seatbelt. Name one good reason to wear a seatbelt. None come to mind immediately. You do. Exactly. Are you wearing a seatbelt? Yes. I'm going to take it off. Now at a moment's notice, we could shine out, we could bail out of the car. That's very true, Brucey. I'm already learning so much from you. And I'm just here to teach a couple of young Australian men what it means to be a real police officer on the force. The American way. Oh, yeah, no, we, I do appreciate that. Yeah. America has no big history of, like, police violence or anything, so... Oh, no, cops are actually very well respected in my country. What's all this then? Brucey, I got out of my uh my car so quick without that seatbelt, bro. That's what I'm saying. What Hello. I'm saying. Hey mate. What are you up to? I'm about to be late to a wedding. Um that starts in about fifteen minutes. Oh, do you want a police escort? Okay. We, we yeah, should, that'd be we great. Should, yeah, we... There's a guy flying over in a paraglider. Oh my god, there is. We should try and shoot him down later if it comes to that. Well, he could be a terrorist trying to drop a bomb and ruin this wedding. We need to prevent that at any any cost. He almost certainly is. Let's offer some security or something for this wedding, huh? Wolfie's yeah, already absolutely. gracing him up a little bit. Oh, here, hang on. What we'll say is that there was a, there was a bomb threat, oh, so good. we're here to provide security. Good. Then we get to eat the free food. Good. Yeah. You're genius. See, I'm learning yeah. so much from you, man. Hey, mate. Hey, mate. Hello, sir. How are you? I'm good. How are you, bro? Not much, man. Yeah, We're just man, here to bad. provide any help we can. We help to give the escort to this lovely truck that you have for the DJ. We also heard that there was um, some kind of bomb threat here at the wedding. So yeah, so we're here just to make sure that uh, everything is okay. Bad. Nothing to worry about. We're here to make sure everything's fine. <laughs> a bomb threat. Nothing to worry about. Nothing to worry about. There's literally nothing to worry about. We're, we're literally, it was just a threat called in. We think it's a hoax. All day. We think maybe There's it was a swatting. Okay. Oh, yeah, what is this guy? Yeah, is this yeah, the groom? Yeah. This is the groom over here? Yeah, yeah, hey, yeah. Hey, whoa, dude, you got a nice haircut. You're looking fresh. Talk to you down. Dude. I have a massive day for you, man. You look good. There's lines in the sky, bro. He looks like fucking Napoleon Bonaparte. Yeah. <laughs> Talking about <laughs> on his wedding day. <laughs> on his fucking <laughs> wedding <laughs> day. <laughs> on your wedding day. Ah man, yeah, I got yeah. myself a little uh, cab mellow. Oh wow, well, it's a beautiful little accoutrement. Yeah. Love how you just grab yourself a drink out because not even bring us not one. A bartender, bro. Look at those bridesmaids. Hey, I can inspect. I can inspect more than just your police force. Hey, am I right? <laughs> You're <yeah>? right. <laughs> <laughs> right. You see, which one you want? Cause it'll be your wingman. Ooh, the one with the flowers with the red hair. Got it, cause I'll be right back. Hello, ma'am. How are you? How are you? Wait, you're not actually dressed for a wedding, are you? I heard about this earlier and didn't have time to get ready. That's no excuse. Ooh, that's no excuse. no excuse at all. Do you know how fucked up it is to rock uh, up at a wedding you're not invited right. to and assume okay. that you're a guest? All right. Hold on, hold on a minute. Uh, what? You need to you need to hold on. You need to hold on. You cuffed me. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You need to hold on. 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 You need to
Hey, you need a, you need to hold on. This yeah. is how the American yeah. place. <laughs> we worked on the wedding car. <laughs> Hello. Ma'am, ma'am. Hello there. How are you doing? Um, yeah, good. Yeah. Right Yo, no. We're just here to uh, oh, keep unwanted oh, guests oh, away. Oh, Was this woman mean, invited or? Um. I don't think so, but I mean, she can stay, I guess. Did you say take her away? Yeah, if you want to. Uh, uh, Excuse me, um, was this... Was... What did she do, officer? No, well, I'm just wondering, was she invited? She said she was invited, but I uh, couldn't even name your name. What's, What's your, your name, name? name? It's Chloe, but... um. Perhaps she can stay at the wedding, but she has to stay in cuffs, because we just need to ensure your safety. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. All right, that's a good happy medium, Chloe, right? Can Chloe be one of the bridesmaids, or is that a step too far? Um, we have like a layout and everything. Yeah, yeah right. Yeah, yeah, yeah Chloe, that was yeah, actually rude no. of you to even make me ask that. All right, have a beautiful <laughs> wedding, guys. I, I didn't. But, but, I mean, it's just the tip, right? But what? What are oh, you guys just, talking about? Nothing, oh, nothing, nothing. nothing, nothing. No, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just getting. Sluffy. I'm just talking Sluffy, with the Let's get them a moment, bro. Come yeah, on, come yeah, on. Yeah, right. Brucey was saying he's gonna give her the tip, and she's like, just the tip between you and me. I think Bruce Brucey's got a small dick. Oh no, Chloe. Chloe's starting to fucking freak me out a bit. Who's Chloe? The, the yeah. girl in cuffs. Kill I mean, maybe. I have no bad ideas, right? Maybe she was the one that planted the bomb. Oh we're my here. Maybe God. we can announce to everyone that we found the bomb, um, and then everyone's safe, and then they'll think we're heroes. Shit, that's a great idea. That's a great idea. So I announce that shit right now. Okay. No, no, no. I think they're Welcome literally to about the... to do the ceremony. Oh, shit. <laughs> Inter... Hey, boys, just quickly. We found the person that had the bomb. She had a C4 shoved up her ass. What? Take a seat anyway? Yeah, sounds good. Can I ask you an honest question now, girl? Yeah. How did you get that, that C4 up the prison pocket? Hello, everyone. I, and welcome. I didn't. Shh, stop talking. Your ceremony today, started. A huge thanks to everyone who has joined for us chum. today. Yeah! And yeah! <laughs> Thank you! These two hitched quickly away. It's just fucking beautiful, our Australia. All over water was true love. I don't even believe in marriage is a kind to You guys wouldn't happen to have a really tissue, would you? This is actually really beautiful. Shut the f oh, up, Chloe. No, no, it's, it's a wedding. I don't know why she's marrying someone that, that looks like Napoleon Bonamara. Oh, because I'll put my baton through your little glass before I was motherfucker. Keep it zipped. It's a wedding. Be respectful. Shh. You may kiss in it. Yeah! 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 Awesome! Feel free to visit the party bus. Uh, Brucey, do you got a chub too, or is it just me? Thanks hey, congratulations, us, right? big guy. Big Thanks, day for dude. you. Thanks, Congrats, dude. bro. Day for you. You hitched. Would you like to do um, a speech? Oh, yes. Oh, please. 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 Can yeah, we do a speech? Like... Would you like the three of us please. to do a speech together? Yes. 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 Just like freestyle yeah. like it. Be honor. All right. <clears throat> what are the bride and groom's name? I think it's um, Anna and um, uh, Paul. First up and foremost, ladies and gentlemen. Thank all the special guests for making their way to the observatory today. It's fine Thursday afternoon. We'd also like to congratulate Anna and Paul, newlyweds. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> everyone laugh, Bruce. Is their name not Paul? <laughs> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Hold on, guys. Give me a minute. I just gotta read my notepad and make sure I got this right. Hold on. Anna Mateo, fucking hell, Bruce. You stitched me up. Uh. I'm sorry. I thought of Anna Paul, the the, the beautiful bodacious babe. I haven't known Paul long, really? but from what I've what I can see, he's a stand up guy. I got this look. I've known Mateo for a long time. Would like to tell a tale from when he first turned 18. Oh no. It was 18th birthday. Me, Michael, Brad, and Gary was best friends. Took him to the local strip club. He went into one of the cubicles. As he was taking piss there to the left, saw nothing other than a glory hole. <laughs> We've all been there. We've all been there. He looked to his left hand side. There he saw the glory hole. It was about two millimeters in diameter. And he knew he was the man for the job. Like an octopus. Oh, no. There it went. He filled that hole with something very small. And on the other side of the cubicle, was the niece? Well, sorry, what's the price name again? <laughs> Anna. They on the other side of the cubicle oh, was no other than Anna. And let's just say yeah, they are today. Oh, no. Hey, hey don't worry, talk about a blind date. There's family here, dude. What a beautiful speech. I just want to say, guys, everybody here, thank you so much for being a part of this beautiful, wonderful day. It is a day like no other. Between me and you guys, I want you to know I don't uh, believe in marriage is a concept. But there's beautiful wine to drink and celebrations to be had and prenups to be signed. <laughs> it just slips off. 
I'm so happy for the f***ing two of you. You guys are awesome. There was a bomb threat here earlier, which is why we were Mate. here. Mate, the to... only bomb here is you. Hey, because I'm because I'm hot or because I'm I'm doing a bad job. Wait, what? Am I bombing? There's small ships. There's big ships. There's tall ships, and there's long ships. But most importantly, there's friendships, and that's what you, Anna, and Paul have. A beautiful, beautiful oh. friendship. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> friends at my wedding. I hope you know you're getting called Paul from now on. Oh, fuck Let's off. Give these guys a round of applause for their speeches, guys. Oh, uh, thank you. Thanks for having us here. Before we go, can we get a round of applause for a glory hole? Hey. 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 Yeah. You guys are on duty. I can't believe this shit. <laughs> well, our work here is done, Brucey. How did you think we went? You're, you're here at value. I think, I think we went amazing, man. I had a nice conversation with that lady in cuffs. Yeah, she was a yeah, interesting, was... interesting one. Really didn't like to be touched. Well, that's a worrying thing to have said. Thank oh. you for coming. No worries. You guys are amazing. Oh, you were great too. Oh, you, you. Have you had a bit too oh, much no. to drink? No. You guys look trashed. Not at all. Really? I think they're, they're super sober. Here, hang on. Yeah, hey, ladies, I have a breathalyzer at home. I left it See, in my bedroom. 100%. Oh, crap. In, in Where's my that? Other, in my other pants. Oh, oh, we need to go and have a look. Where's that? Because I can't drive. Yeah. Let's all say I'm one so thing excited. we like about each other, starting with the bridesmaid to my left. Um, my boobs? That's amazing <laughs> self-love. Can I? I, too, can, yeah. I, too, choose your boobs. Thank you. All right. Brucey? Her boobs? I love her boobs and her boobs. I like all the boobs. <laughs> boobs are great. I like boobies. We're all on the same page here. I wish yeah, I could turn boobs like I can turn a page. Just back and forth forever. Yeah. I mean, that would be pretty f awesome, I ain't gonna lie. Anyway, thank you so much Ooh. for a beautiful day, but I only really talk to women who are like seven or plus, so I'll talk to you guys soon. Well, oh, I, fuck. I mean, are you assuming my age? That's <laughs> Bye, gentlemen. See you thank later. Thank you again for coming. Goodbye. <laughs> See you later, girls. Take it easy. See you on the flip flopper. Oh, she got you, dude. She got you. She actually got you. That's a great night, man. Oh, they were nice yeah. ladies. Let's go find some crime, boys. Yeah, we should pull somebody over for no reason. What's the sheriff, is it? Yeah, pull oh, over. Oh, yeah? What's in? No way. How can you pull over? Pull over now. Pull over your vehicle. We need you to pull over. Any idea why we put you over here today? That's a fake cop. Why are you driving a fake cop around uh, it? Are you, um, ma'am, excuse me, fake Can cop? What does it say on his skivvy? What does it say on my neck? Fake my neck. police. It says police. You can't just deny reality. Anyway, I'll get you to step out of the vehicle, please, sir and ma'am. What? Hands up, up against the railing. You guys got any drugs on you? You guys been drinking and driving tonight? No. Because I'm pretty sure your buddy here just said I was a fucking fake cop. How about an apology? Oh. I, think, I think we can all move forward if you apologize to him for calling him a fake cop. He's a fake cop. No, that's... What, is... what is with this incredible oh, police oh, response? Did you hit the oh, f***ing panic button? You get... What are you... Oh, you mate. So these guys pull over and they obviously transport someone and then they want to randomly search us with no proper cause. Well, what fake cop? I don't see any fake cop. Right, yo. Hey, man. Hey, what's going on? Yeah, this lady over here said that I was a fake cop when in reality I am an international police inspector here to evaluate your whole force. Lexi, he's telling the truth. He actually is telling the truth, as surprising as that might be. Telling the truth. <laughs> you have the entire police force here to check me out. We're here because the uh, sheriffs sent us a ping. So you call yeah. the police on the right. police? What is right. going right. on here? Right. So, 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 so you see a guy with a tight leather jacket, firm ass, and some great speed dealers, and you think to yourself, I need to call backup? You couldn't handle me yourself? You didn't have a cause to search us, and you didn't tell us why you were searching us. We did. We were very explicit in what we said. We handled this very no, professionally. I can check my body cam. You pulled them over, you, you hit the panic button oh, like you fell down the, the fucking stairs. We've got the force is leaning on that railing now. <laughs> How about this? You just apologized to Bruce Brucey and promised not to drink drive anymore, and then I think yeah, we can, can move on. I can let bike guns. I wasn't drink driving. I can let bike guns. Someone apologize for that. Don't talk over me. I can let bike guns be bike guns. Lexi, apologize. Lexi? If I'm apologizing, don't, don't, Lexi, for don't talk over me. Lexi, stop well. talking, stop talking over me. Lexi, you have, you have the floor for a second. Go, Lexi. Okay, I'm Lexi, sorry. Lexi, you have the floor. Say your piece. Lexi, say your piece. You're, you're not supposed to be talking over him. He's asking to talk. No, no, Lexi, sorry. No, no, no. We're getting confused. Talk, you go, Lexi. The floor's yours. The floor's yours. The floor is yours. The floor is yours. Now you apologize to Bruce Brucey immediately. You not apologize to me. Feel free. Apologize. Whatever the f*** is. Convenient!
I'm la, sorry. La, 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 la. Wow, wow. She's she sorry. Is yeah, so is that sorry. sorry. I think yep, this is all yep, handed, so boys. I'm so sorry. Okay. I'm here to set this straight, okay? Just so you guys know, I'm not a fake cop. I'm tired of people saying I'm a fake cop. Yeah, you say your pace, Percy. I fucking went to a training academy. Okay, I was the shortest guy in my fucking class. You know, you know how annoying that was? I bet it was frustrating for you. Can we all salute the fake cop? Hey! <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck, man? Everybody, let's chant Brucey. Brucey, 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 Try to find them or arrest them. We, we have 30 more by the end of the month. We need to hit 30. And don't wear your seatbelt, okay? In all caps, repeat after me. Don't, don't wear, wear your seatbelts. Seat don't, don't wear your seatbelts. Seat 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 Brucey can pass his knowledge on us like a wise monk, and we should all be very appreciative of yes. that. The wise monk from New York. All right, lads. We'll see you soon. Can you believe those crummy sheriffs called the police on the police? I can't, I can't believe they thought I was a fake cop and called every fucking police officer. <laughs> they hit the panic button. But I think you handled it well. I think you turned it into a really enriching learning moment. How are you, mate? Reaching human. Oh, I see. You had them here, too. Illegal aliens. Illegal aliens. But I was like... I landed here in my spaceship. Yeah, yeah all right, buddy. It's a pretty thick accent, buddy. Crush... Earth being, yeah, yeah, all right, yeah. yeah. Earth being, where are you from, buddy? What state, what state are you from? Earth. He's technically right, I guess. He is. He, you know, look, buddy, you're getting off on a technicality here. Are you drunk and or high or under the influence of any substances? I have ingested plenty of water today. Well, I do want to, yeah, what does that do to your physiology, buddy? You just want to make you drunk or something? Put your hand, but put, put your hands behind your back, Put your mouth, hands up, man. I'm going to, I'm going to search you. Put your hands this is suspicious as hell. Why do you have a Brush. dagger on you, mate? This is my knife. I use it to cover up your cats and dogs for sustenance. You ate our pets? All right, okay, What is this, buddy, China? Okay, He's like, mate, get in the car. We're going to take you back to where you came from. Put your seatbelt on, young man. Oh, my God. Give him just a hit to see if he's immortal, bro. Hit him. If he gets oh. up, then he's the mortal. You ready? Oh, sir. I believe you need to slow down so I can attach this device. Put on your seatbelt, mate. <laughs> he's, just... <laughs> he's just done it again. There we go. I have attached the device. Yeah, yeah, man. You're a real fucking annoying alien. <laughs> <laughs> All right, come with us, mate. All right, big boy. Swim. We don't like illegal aliens in Australia. Swim. Get going, buddy. My species anyway. cannot enter such a body Swim. of water. We Swim. <laughs> Swim straight out. I like the way you guys handle business down here. In, in, in America, we have a whole border. It's just f***ing open. Our duty's done here, I think. Jay Walker, run them over, run them over, teach them, run them over. Hey, mate, what are you doing? What the f*** are you doing, mate? <laughs> Buddy, you were just f***ing jaywalking. You know how f***ing you know dangerous, how dangerous jaywalking, jaywalking is? is, man? You could get hit by a f***ing car and get I'm really, sorry. really hurt. Yeah. Get the f*** out of here. Oh, real oh, shit, he's got a gun! <laughs> Seems like a little bit of brutality there. Oh, mate, don't tell it. Stop making acute observations, mate. You are jaywalking, and that's the real crime here. Get on the ground. Whoa, oh, I'm Get sorry. Get on the f***ing ground. Now, what did you learn about jaywalking today? Don't jaywalk, otherwise, cops. Use an adjective oh, in front of the cops. Cops will what? Cops will. No, what, what will kind of cops are we? Cool cops. I'll take cool. That's right. Cool cops yeah. will pull over, pull you over and discipline you. They will, yes. The blood started what shooting, brother. Just the hood. Just the locals, man. Just anyway, we caught this gentleman jaywalking. What a bad criminal he is. What do you reckon we should do, sir? How do we handle this? Oh, I reckon throw the book at him. I reckon. Yep. I reckon 60 yeah, weeks in prison? Yeah. 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 Probably, yeah. Oh, get the quotas Life in prison. That's the one. You have the right to remain silent. Anything oh. you say in court will or will 100% be used against you, you piece of fucking shit. Take him away, boys. What was your name, mate? Terry. Terry, the good news is we can't really be bothered taking you to prison, so we're just going to let you off with a very harsh warning, all right? I got a quick question. Yes. How come the guy in front of me, the bald one, wearing oh, like those wow. vests like you guys? Oh, wow. So so now I'm the bald so one. So now he's the, yeah, bald, the bald one. one. I'm the bald wow, one. Wow, Terry. The bald one. Fuck's sake, I'm Terry. Bald. You could have said the guy with the cigarette behind his ear. You could have said the guy with the sunglasses. It looks cooler than the Straight other guy with bald. the sunglasses. Oh, Straight to bald. Straight to bald. Right. He's well, sorry, like buddy. Hey, I'm sorry I was the shortest guy in the military training academy. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry I was... 
fucking co- a, f- a fake cop, apparently. I'm a fake cop. We're gonna let you out, and, and, and if you keep talking, maybe we'll do something else to you. I'm gonna be right here. We'll let's go inside. Let's get the firefighter to spray the hose at him. Oh, that's a good idea. We're just gonna give you a little hose down, mate. Yeah, I kind of need it. I haven't showered in like seven days. Seems like a big win-win then. Hello, fellas. G'day, mate. It's going, boys? I have a special request as police inspector Bruce Brucey from the Liberty City Police Department. I would like you to take this beautiful piece of engineering. I'm gonna try to wash the fucking gang tattoos off of this this little bastard skin. We kind of jaywalking. We got him jaywalking, but we feel like prison's too harsh, so we feel like a firm fire hose should do the job. Don't they like run at like 2,000 psi? Yeah, it's gonna hurt, but it'll learn a valuable oh, lesson. Give him a hose, boys. Oh. Might be a sectary. Step aside, Smurfy. You got this. You got this, sir. You get me wet, I'll tase you, and then you'll die of a heart attack. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> boldy, boldy over there. What's it like to have no hair? Is it hot or is it cold? I don't know, because I'm not bold. That's the rocket. Well. We gotta go, we gotta the resale. Let's go. All right. See you, Terry. Thank you. I think they're below us, huh? Oh, yep. Take the shortcut. Jesus Christ. Yeah, there we go. Oh, shit. Additionals have arrived. Oh, oh, gunshot. Yeah, fire behind. We got two units He's down. down guys. He's down. He's dead. Taser, taser. He's dead. I don't think Brucey realizes he's already dead. <laughs> <laughs> no, Brucey. <laughs> Chill out, Brucey. Taser, taser, taser. Dead, all right, well, it looks like this all got handled pretty perfectly. We'll get on the road. Yeah, I, all thanks to me. But yeah, Brucey really stepped up to the plate as usual. I made him stop resisting. Did you see him? Everyone see that? I made him say he was resisting. You did. You made him stop. All right, cheers, gentlemen. See you soon. Well, well, everyone's out here. All the cops are there. We can go find some other crime. What are they doing out here? Whoa! Don't cut Whoa! Whoa! Oh, Super oh, Mario oh, Bros. Oh, oh, the oh. They're running. Get 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 are they going to throw some bananas at us? Victoria police, pull over! Victoria police, pull over immediately, young lady. Oh shit! What? Follow him, follow him, Wolfie, follow him. Are oh, they gonna have an advantage in here? Oh, you think we can't make tight turns? Oh, you scratching my boy! Your boy, and you too, bitch! Oh! Oh, ah. <laughs> oh shit, he's got, oh, shit. he's got a gun, he's got a gun! Shoot him! Put out a fucking torch. Brucey got him out! Nice, Brucey! Alright, we got him, boys. Take me to the hospital! Oh yeah, I'll take you to the hospital, man, no worries. <laughs> yeah. oh, man, look at him, G. He's a real police officer now. Yeah. Well, another crime solved, boys. I like that. My first my first Australian involved shooting. Yeah, dude, you did really well. You capped it, man. I pulled out a fucking flashlight. Do you know what it was this evening? What? what? Didn't have the seatbelt on. <laughs> Didn't have the seatbelt on. Always one step ahead, Brucey. The <laughs> artist. No helmet! Run them off! Oh, no, no, helmet. Helmet. no helmet! No helmet! Hey! <laughs> oh! <laughs> hey! Dude. Do I fucking look like dude to you? Officer, Officer fucking Brucey! It's Officer Brucey. Read him. You distracted me enormously. Yeah, you where's your. Where, are you sure it wasn't your fucking lack of a helmet? You, you fucking wise guy? All right, I'm gonna hey. write you a ticket for having no helmet, all right? And I'm gonna repossess your vehicle. I don't appreciate this. I don't appreciate you not wearing a helmet, okay? See? Look. Brucey has a helmet. <laughs> helmet Just wear the helmet, all right? Jack. There's your ticket. And uh, if I catch you out here wearing a helmet again, I will seriously T-burn your car, or bike, whatever. Bro, there's no way he just broke it. Can you still actually like, drive away for two seconds? I think Brucey put him in cuffs. Oh, no. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Man, they're all in America different, huh? He just pulled a gun on me. Did he pull a gun, actually? We lost him. It's all right. He learned a valuable lesson about helmets today. Well, do you think we should drop Brucey back at the airport? My flight is in like two hours. Oh, so we better get you back there, bro. Yeah, I forgot that you're only here for one night, eh? I guess before we go, it would be good to get like a, a final evaluation on how oh, you sure. think we did today. Sure, yeah. Beautiful. Oh wow, synchronized. All right, Brucey, lay it on. Don't oh. sugarcoat it. How did we do? Okay, well, we're going to start with Officer... What was your name? Steve Wolf. Wolfie, right. Okay. We'll go down to the individual before we hit your overall. Okay, so driving skill. You've got yourself an A, a steady A. Wow. Straight. That's, That's so surprising. In terms of your ability to negotiate and, and speech, I would say I'd put you at like a, a pretty C. I say C. Wow, See? that's harsh, man. Yeah. You did have a little bit of an issue with the wedding where you kind of 
exposed the groom and bride in front of e everybody. My bad for that, brother. Was a little out of pocket to make me giggle. So right here in funny and likability, yeah, you, you you got a solid B plus there. Wow, it's pretty okay. good, man. Overall, I would say as a police officer, yeah, no, you're 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 showing out it like a great B. I appreciate that, Bruce. Say that's very generous of you, cuz I take the feedback on board, and you know, me and Smithy always trying to be better every of single course. shift, eh? And Mr. Smithy, yes, your sir. driving skill, um, I'm gonna have to track you up for probably about a ooh. Yeah, maybe like a maybe like a D. What the hell? A D? <laughs> oh, oh, okay. What's my next well, grade, look, Brucey? For intimidation, you're you A plus. A plus uh, for that's, intimidation. No, I'm gonna that's good. And for speech and charisma, yeah, I'd even say an A, an A across the board for that. Now I'm not sure if uh, I over, believe these grades because I intimidated you a bit. Overall rating? I mean you are tall, I am the shortest person of my police academy. You uh, did mention. I don't think I've ever brought it up once. For your overall rating, I would say, you know, uh, honestly, Mr. Sh Mr. Uh, what, what was it again? Uh, I'm a little intim intimidating. Uh, friends call me Smithy, so just call me Smithy, Mario Smith. Smithy, Mario Smith. I would say that your overall rating, definitely a B plus. Or hey, I would even say, I'll take a B plus. I would, even, I would even say an A. I would even say oh, an, an, a. an A. A minus. I don't want to add the minus. Because it's kind of a damper on the A. B hey, look, I'll take an A minus, man. That's like honestly the highest. Yeah, and yeah. and your overall department score is. Oh god. Oh yeah. It's a fucking D, man. That's all right. I'll, that's harsh. The but department. Fair. The department did not do a good job. First of all, your fucking sheriff called the entire squad on me. Second of all, your your literal commissioner that they're supposed to pick me up at the airport and, and do this whole thing with. This fucking car broke down. Listen, it's unprofessional. It's very unprofessional. Very, very unprofessional. Well, Bruce, it was an honor running with you, mate. Hopefully you're back in the country again soon. Gentlemen, the honor was all mine. You're a good man, deep, Bruce Brucey. Deep, deep from my American heart. You're a good, good man. You two, you two are the only stand-up cops in this entire rotten, dirty fucking city. Well, I appreciate oh, that, and I agree with that. And you're not too too taller than me. You're not you're not too much taller. Uh, we're all like than me. weirdly the exact same height. No, you got an entry two inches on me, but is that why you wear platform shoes? The why I uh, my I'm gonna be late for my flight, gentlemen. I'll I hope I see you two gentlemen again. See you later, Brucey. I'm sure it won't be the last time, mate. Love you. Ah, I'm gonna miss Brucey. I'm gonna miss Brucey too, man. I guess we got pretty good scores. I guess better than C's and D's. We got A's and B's. I think we did all right, Wolfie. I think we did all right.